dynamics anyway. But now enter the role of AI, mm -hmm. right? The kids, whether or not, and this is something like Andrew and I have talked about before, and this is not new to the this this it show. Yes, for sure. But even if people aren't directly engaged in the tool, so mm -hmm. we can use generative AI for an example, even if they are part of a vulnerable population, part of a population that's been excluded from these tools, either by access or they might live in a part of the world that doesn't have power yet in yes. terms of, right? So I mean, yeah. but even in that situation, and even with kids who are maybe even at, depending on their age, depending on access, depending on the school system, whatever, even if they have not yet directly engaged with like an AI tool with chat GPT sure. or with it, like they are still being, their experiences are still being influenced, shaped, determined, created, augmented, reviewed, etc. They're still living in this world that has been changed by the use of these tools and will continue to do so. And yes. so the question then is, what's going to happen? What is, what's going to, what do we, I mean, what, how do we feel about it? What do we think is going to happen? I don't know. 